Hey there, viewers. So, I had to do some looking around and figure out where to go from here. And, can't believe I missed this. There's some discarded clothing in the bushes. It looks like a pair of workmen's Although, to coveralls. be fair... Maybe the West Polynesian Dongcatcher Although, to be fair, this wasn't in the original game, so... It's pretty easy to miss. You take the coveralls out of the bushes. So now we have to look inside the coveralls, yeah. and we got a key now. Now go back down to the second floor where we saw that locked door. The key fits in the lock. You turn the bolt and the door easily opens. See how that works there? Yeah, baby! You walk through a maze of twisty little passages, all alike, until finally you walk through an archway and into... Holy guacamole! With the humidity at about 150%, your leisure suit immediately wilts, sadly. A feeling not wholly unfamiliar <laughs> to you. Au contraire, Pierre. The humidity will make my suit cling to my body and show off my physique. Uh-huh. Well, it seems we have another lady over here. An incredibly sexy woman, the hotel's mermaid, stands by the edge of the pool. Yeah, baby. She stands before you, totally unselfconscious of her near nakedness. That's encouraging. Yes. Who are you? What are you doing here? And how did you get in? This is a restricted area. Me? I'm Larry. <laughs> Larry Laffer, I found a key that fits this door. That's kind of what I do. Wow, points for boldness then, Mr. Laffer. Call me Larry. Okay, Larry. I'm Jasmine. So what do you do here? I work here. I ride Mr. Wiggles bareback. Mr. Wiggles is a very, very <laughs> lucky man. Mr. Wiggles is my whale. Don't act like you didn't know that. I'm just trying to be charming. Maybe it's working. Oh, maybe you have a chance with this one, Larry. Jasmine, how do you hold your breath so long? I can't swim across the kiddie pool underwater. You must have great lungs. Yeah, I guess I'm just well endowed. You can say that again. Come again? Yes. What? How did you know? Huh? <coughs> Let's start over. So, Jasmine, tell me, how does one get a gig doing nothing but whaleback riding? Oh, I do much more than that. Riding Mr. Wiggles is just the fun part. I also get to feed him and clean up after him when he gets sick and carefully cleanse his blowhole. Really? That's funny. I've got a... Don't go down <laughs> that path, Larry. You'll blow it. Ah, I mean, I've got a feeling. A feeling that that's a terrible job. Why don't you quit? What? And <laughs> give up show business? Gee, Jasmine. For a girl who's around fish all day, you sure do smell good. Oh, thank you. It is difficult to stay fresh. Your perfume is fantastic. Thanks, Larry. I guess you could say that I'm somewhat of a perfume connoisseur. Larry, a connoisseur is one who understands the details, techniques, and principles of an art, and is competent to act as a critical judge. I actually knew that. So, you understand the details, techniques, and principles of perfume, and are competent to act as a critical judge? Exactly! Gosh, Larry, it's like you know me, inside and out. Or you just inside? repeat what the narrator wow. said. Just wow! Perfume's my passion. I have, like, literally a thousand perfumes. Some of them are really, really, really expensive. I don't think there's one I don't have. Hmm. You always wear perfume? Oh, yes. A lot of the time, that's all I wear. Oh my <laughs> god! Oh my happy, happy god! 
Well then, I guess it's safe to assume you don't need more perfume. Are you kidding? I'm dying for something new. Something fresh. Something original. But at this point, I don't think there's a man on Earth who could come up mm. with that. There's your cue, Larry. But where are you going to find a unique perfume that she's never smelled before? Well, what if we made our own? It's great to meet you, Jasmine. I'll be back in a flash with something you're going to love. No need to hurry, Larry. I'm about to go on break, but I really hope I see you later. We have that magazine article that mentioned how you can make perfume. So we just need to find some ingredients. You start to pick up the creel, but it's sopping wet. You decide you don't really need all those squid. Excuse me, that's Mr. Wiggle's food. He might not like it with someone else's body stink on it. But nothing personal. How could I possibly take that personally? You jiggle the nearest locker. It's locked, hence the name. Anything in these lockers? You jiggle, hence the name. You hence the you hence the you hence the you hence you doesn't look like it. You hence the you hence the you hence you hence you hence you hands you hands you hands the you hands the Mr. Wiggles, the casino's whale, is frolicking merrily in the huge aquarium. We need to do something aquarium. with that whale, because one of the ingredients is amber. You can't breeze, reach Mr. Wiggles AKA while he's whale swimming. vomit. So we got to get the whale to vomit somehow. You scoop up a bit of the water and rub it between your fingers. I'm guessing two parts hydrogen, five parts oxygen. The sign is a list of precautions, such as high salt content pool, remove fillings before swimming. We have hot sauce, will that work? You're on the right track, but try a more direct approach with the mm. hot sauce. Says we're on the right track. Put in his food. You're on the no. right track, but tr you're on the right. Tr don't give the whale any nasty surprises. At least not with Jasmine around. Oh, we gotta wait till she's gone, huh? Oh, let's just try leaving then. Say that magazine article. Flowers and alcohol. Need that. Yeah, the amber grease and civet. Extract from the anal glands of a cat like animal. We've seen a cat around, I believe. This machinery probably maintains the pool's salinity, oxygenation, and other technical stuff that doesn't interest you. You... Okay. Use your key, <laughs> Larry. Yeah, I guess we gotta use the key every time we enter there. This is well, ha I'm welcome. You took. Ah, oh, there we go. There's nobody here. Jasmine must have gone on break. Mr. Wiggles seems to be taking a break. Yeah, let's, uh, let's give him a little pick me up. Carefully, you tip the hot sauce bottle into Mr. Wiggles' blowhole and pour out the entire contents. Bubbles rise to the top of the sauce as it slowly glugs down into the whale's inner recesses. Don't try this at home. Yeah, Easy there, big fella. He can't take anymore! He's gonna blow! 
Deep within the aquarium, the overspiced whale gives a mighty heave. Something floats to the surface of the aquarium. Mr. Wiggles swims away, snorking constantly. <laughs> All right, we ab we abuse the helpless whale, and we get some amber. Unless grease. you miss your guess, and you usually do, Mr. Wiggles has upchucked some amber grease. It could be something else, but let's just not go there. You kneel and scoop the water towards yourself until the amber grease is within reach. It's gooey and revolting, and you stick it in your pocket without a second thought. You're not really capable of second thoughts. You never know when a recently deceased squid will come in handy. Yes. Yeah, baby. Got a squid out of his food basket now. Okay, it said we also need civet. So let's go find a cat and do some uh, morally questionable things to that now. Breath! Putrid! Oi, they! I think I've seen a cat around here. Maybe we just need to just need to walk around until it shows up. Still can't get off the there. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. You don't need any of that litter. At least not now. Careful, Larry. That succubus is not to be trusted. I don't know what a succubus is, but it sounds fantastic. You would think that, Larry. Hello, kitty. Here, kitty, 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 kitty. There it is. It wouldn't let us. Hey, you're not supposed it to let us using... walk up to it before, but now that we have, we have food for it. You hold the squid out to the cat. You quickly grab one of the used syringes lying all too plentifully around lost wages. Oh, jeez. With a startling adeptness that raises questions about what you do <laughs> in your free time, you extract the fluid from the cat's musk glands. The cat runs off without so much as a vengeful backwards glance that might foreshadow a sequel, or at least a really bloody scene later. Congratulations! You've got the best available local civet. Score! Yeah, baby! Okay, now we need flowers and alcohol. I These know where to gorgeous, find the alcohol. exotic West Polynesian dong catchers are thriving in the desert heat. It's we nice to know to something is thriving flower. around here. Amazingly, the plant's unterrible leaves are somehow bolted to the roots, which are somehow bolted to the soil, which is bolted to the pot, which is bolted to the sidewalk. Okay. You stealthily snitch a large, fragrant jasmine blossom. Ah, uh, yes, jasmine, because her name is Jasmine. Haha, <laughs> get it. You still have that empty hot sauce bottle. Tax 
see. So now. I should have known. Okay, where to And back next? to lefties. That'll be 16 bucks, please. There's a phone number on one of the business cards. Sierra off ramp. What show nine six eight three six eight five eight? I think that might have actually been the number for Sierra's helpline. Thanks, kid. Maybe we'll try that on the phone later if we get a chance. Plenty of alcohol here. Hello. Where'd it be? I'm gonna guess that's what the vodka's for, since that wasn't there before. I want to do some serious damage. Give me a vodka. That'll be five dollars, please. You flip five bucks onto the counter. You don't drink the vodka. Instead, you carry it around in the shot glass because you simply never know when you'll need a shot of vodka. And now we just need to mix everything together. Yeah, baby! Some uh, serviceable perfume. Yep, now let's go give that to Jasmine. says 23 bucks pay up thanks kid You let yourself in. Larry, I was wondering where you'd gone. You have anything Matter for me? Matter of fact, we do. Get a whiff of this. She stands before you, totally unselfconscious of her near-nakedness. 
That's encouraging. Yes. Yeah, baby. You pull out your Odalari and lay it on her. <gasps> what is this? I call it Odalari. Oh, Larry, Odalari. Ooh. Did someone just yodel? Anyway, it's the first in my new line. Really? I didn't realize you were a parfumier. Why, yes. Yes, I am. Ever since before. And I created this scent just for you. In fact, I've created several scents today just thinking about you. But this is the only one I bottled. Intriguing. Jasmine opens the bottle, waves it in the air, and inhales the lingering aroma. You bad boy. It's Jasmine. What else? She inhales again. And is that civet? Sort of. Ooh, la la. And there's something else. Tabasco? Well, maybe just a little. Do you like it? It's a very unusual combination. There's something else. Something rare and valuable. That's right. Wow, Jasmine. Your nostrils are like two beautiful bloodhounds. My god. You know just what to say, don't you? Is that ambergris? Exactly. How exotic! And it's from Mr. Wiggles, uh, too! Wait, oh, Larry? What? You'd be surprised. Huge uh, whale like that. You just give oh, him a little no, Larry, bottle you're... of Tasteless Dave's Shut butt up, Larry. hot sauce. What? Of course, you can't dilute it in the aquarium water. You have to pour it straight into the you're bowl. You're blowing it, Larry! What? You gave hot sauce to Mr. Wiggles? You screaming douche puppet! Screaming what now? How dare you assault a defenseless whale! Defenseless? He weighs 40 tons! Mr. Wiggles is my best friend! You're horrible! I never want to see you again! Get out and don't come back! So I bet you don't want to know how I got the civet. Get out! How about we make passionate love just once, for old time's sake? Get out, get out, get out! Uh, way to go, Larry. A little too honest there. Thing back there. Oh, one of the lockers is open now. You recognize that? It's one of those little kits with rubber patches and a bottle of special glue. It's for fixing minor holes in rubber and vinyl yeah. items. You snag the little kit. Rubber patches. Now, what do we do with that? Doesn't do anything with the helium. Anything that I don't seem to have anything I can combine it with. So we went through all that for some patches. So now what do we do with those? Well I guess I'll just have to do some more looking around. I'll see you guys next time. See you guys later. I'm playing a game.